Kuya Crew, sobrang dami nating pwedeng interviewin pero ang um, swerte ako dahil may makakausap tayo ngayong araw na to. I am with Mr. Your name please. Uh, my name is Slava Demchuk. Uh, I'm CEO of Amelbot, the crypto compliance company. How are you feeling today? Oh, it's great. Great. The conference is amazing. There are so many people and this feeling this vibe of upcoming bull run. I, I can feel it. What made you attend this event? Is this your first time or do you always no, no, attend? No, it's probably my second or maybe even third time. Yeah, yeah. I, I like this event. So many people here, right? Let's talk about your company. What do you guys specialize on? So, we are a crypto compliance company. Actually, we provide KYT and KYC solutions for businesses mainly. And also, we have chatbot where anyone can check their address or transaction whether it is connected to some illicit activities in the blockchain. So our main service is to provide protection for businesses that receive or send money in crypto and be protected from everything that happening and connected with the illicit activities. Mm. Like kind of we protect businesses from dirtness. Okay, what makes your company unique? What sets it apart from all the companies that also have the same field? Yes, first of all, we have one of the best coverage in the world because we partnered up with a lot of data providers from United States, from Europe and from Asia as well. So our data coverage is one of the best in the world. And secondly, it's very easy to integrate with us. It's the most easiest process uh, from the legal perspective, from the documentary perspective, and also from the integrational perspective. I would say there's two main benefits working with us as a compliance provider. You have new projects to launch? Yeah, maybe, but we will announce it in our channel. You can check our Telegram channel, amelbot.com, and our Twitter channel, X, now it's X, yeah, uh, amelbot.com as well. And we will announce all of uh, the upcoming projects and features there. What do you think is the future of money? Uh, there are speculation that all of the, the future of money will be totally paperless, but I believe it's gonna be kind of mixed. There are still be countries that prefer cash. There are still be even developed countries. There are some group of people prefer to use cash, but less and less. And the digital currency definitely going to be the future. Maybe 80% to 20 for paper. I have a question, but it's a little bit personal. Do you have a Bitcoin? Oh yeah, sure, sure. I have a Bitcoin, yeah. Since 2000, maybe 16 or something. Yeah, and I hold, I never sell Bitcoin. And that's 2016, right? Am I right? Since 2016. Uh, 2016. Yeah. Now, how many Bitcoins do you have? I will not share this information. <laughs> Thank you so much, Marovit. Dito lang yan sa FOMO, the future of money.